Hey all, no nor here. I know this is a, this is a bit of a different video than what I usually do. Because I for well not the first time, but this is the first time I've bought SMG4 merch or quite a bit of it. So it's not it's not my first time I bought merch. Because as you can see, I've got the Marty keychain. I bought that this is the first piece of SMG4 merch I ever bought. Uh, as you can see, definitely worth it. My favourite character. But uh, I decided to get. Usually, I don't buy YouTuber merch or you know SMG4 merch or whatever. Uh, usually, because I'm just never that interested in it. But this time, I bought quite a bit, and you know, um, mostly because I really like Mr. Puzzles. Like I think he's very cool, and so I couldn't resist getting the the uh, Mr. Puzzles merch. But also because I felt. I felt a sort of a strange sense of obligation to uh, buy this merch because uh, Mr. Puzzles and I and you know the Pole Puzzle Vision arc sort of basically revived my YouTube channel because you know I hadn't uploaded in, March, in January and February and uh, but then I saw the Puzzle Vision stuff started and I made theory videos about it and all that and you know I've got the most views I've gotten on my channel like ever in this year. Uh, I reached 2 million views this year, I uh, got my first animation video to 100,000 and actually I was re-motivated to start doing those again due to the arc and um, also my most viewed PV video, my most viewed showcase video which is also my most viewed video ever now got two videos over 100k now um, obviously I have four in total but you know one in 2022, one in 2023 but I've got two already this year and we're not even halfway through yet, or well, I guess we are now. And so, yeah, there's a sort of sense of obligation since, you know, SMG4 and Mr. Puzzles basically revived my channel, and I've made over like a thousand pounds this year so far. And so, you know, yeah, I, sh I should give back, you know, my successes do turn. And so, I bought the Mr. Puzzles keychain, the Mr. Puzzles clutch, and the desk mat. Now the desk mat came immediately when I ordered it, um, but the puzzle stuff only came yesterday. I thought they were actually going to come in July, I forgot some pre-orders were for, but they came in June, so maybe I'm stupid and I forgot it was June, not July, or they just came earlier. And so I'm going to showcase them. Uh, I apologise for how crap this video is, I don't have a great webcam, I've never done this sort of style of video before, and also... Um, I'm using my webcam mic. I, I've got my Blue Yeti mic. That would be a lot better, but I think it's funnier uh, if my mic is terrible. And so you're going to have to lift that. So uh, let's get started. And um, I can't hold this and take this out of its packaging. So uh, give me a second. actually pretty bigger than I was expecting. I mean sure they probably gave measurements on the website but I was not saying it to be this big to be honest. Uh, so Jesus Christ this is big. This is big. No lie. So uh, but my webcam can't really go too far because uh, it's connected to my computer. And the wire isn't that long. But as you can see, here's the full mat with very nice artwork. Pretty sure this is the same artist for who did the 10 year anniversary arm poster. And I think he does all the posters. And the art looks very good. It's uh, very big, but the art is very nice. Uh, uh, if you look at my. Hang on, I've got spoilers on here for sure, for part two. Alright. So, as you can see, this is my desk mat that I currently use. And this is my entire desk. Now, there's a bit of an issue. This is massive. I mean, sure, it would fit. 
but I'd have to move everything and I'd probably need to dust this because this is a bit dusty and not nice. Um, but yeah, this is quite a bit bigger than my current one. <laughs> but the art is very nice. And the thing is, I'm sort of reluctant to actually use this because one, I don't want to get dust in it or, you know, ruin it in any way because I think the art is very nice. So I'm not really sure what I want to do with it. I might just put it away and then one day I might use it. But, you know, it's too nice to ruin. You know, obviously not going to do this much forever. Uh, so, we'll get, okay, we'll move on to the stuff you actually want now. And, oh yeah, by the way, I My, this, the funny story, if you're wondering about this owl that I have, it's like a outside garden ornament. My uh, friend um, bought this for me. He, he just bought this for me, no reason, he just thought it'd be funny, and so he brought it to university, and I was stuck with this fucking owl, and so luckily one of my friends had a bag, because no, I was busing all the way back on an hour bus ride, there were two buses, just carry this fucking owl, alright, enough of my side tangent, let's go on to the puzzles merch now, which is what we're actually here for, as you can tell, I'm not, no, I don't know what I'm doing, I quite frankly, I don't know what I'm doing. Right. Okay, let's start with... Let's start with this. The, uh, the thing the key chain came on. I'm pretty sure it's supposed to be attached to this thing here, but it wasn't in the packaging, so it came loose. But please stand by. It has the Mr. Puzzles Please Stand By screen uh, image, but without actually the Please Stand By covering up the Puzzle Version logo. More Please Stand By, and then a nice, uh, I think that's the same font that's on his uh, screen. Uh, no, on not screen, on his, uh, you know, head. Um, but obviously that added Mr. And it's Puzzles, not Puzzle Vision. Um, so that's very nice. That's very, is this in focus? I, could, I don't even know. Um, hopefully this looks all, I mean, my webcam shit, it's not going to look good. Alright, so, I'd say, pretty nice, pretty nice. But, actually, let's look at what, you know, the main thing, which I'll still work out with the Okay, on to the, on to the main event, the Mr. Puzzles key, well this isn't the main event, you guys actually have a crush, but, right, here's the keychain, now this is very cool, as you can see, the face, uh, I forgot what this kind of plastic screen is called, but you know, it changes depending on how you look at it, I don't know how to get you guys to see that, the, uh, nor I can see it with my eye, oh, there you are, so it changes, that's really cool actually, I think that's really cool, and you know, it's, it's accurate, uh, those are pretty much exactly what his faces and G model look like. So you know, pretty lit, pretty cool. And what's even cooler is that the back is different. So you see actually the back of him with his uh you know uh you know, the ports at the back and shit. Which I'm pretty sure that's the one the port on the right is an aerial port. I mean on G model it's a bit more clear. And then the two on the left I think are A V ports. Uh, I don't know why I'm telling you that. I just thought that was cool. Anyway, because the ports actually make sense. So I'll put it next to Marty, and I should really just move this closer. As you can see, I'm a professional at reviewing uh, merch and shit, because I've done this before. So there you go, move here next to Marty. Very cool. Alright, and now on to the main event that you're actually all here for. So uh, let me pull it out. Now, this is my first SMG4 plush uh, ever. And I bought, obviously, I was, I, the only thing I bought before was the Marty Keychain. So, uh, and oh my god, this guy looks cool. Uh, there's a bit of an issue uh, I've noticed though. If you look, uh, you see the screen is a bit out. Uh, I don't think that's meant to have happened. Probably a mistake with the shipping, because the shipping's a bit shit, because uh, the Marty Keychain. That came with something like this, and I still got it, it's in my cupboard, but it was kind of bent, which was kind of annoying because the artwork was nice. 
but um, this one is fortunately came in better packaging, um, and this uh, doesn't seem to have come in the best packaging as you can see. Uh, not a deal. I, I could probably fix that if I tried. Um, I don't know how to. Hopefully, this isn't a big deal. Anyway, look at that nice detail though on the plush. So. As you can see, he's got the same thing the keychain has with his face. It changes depending on the angle we look at it or something. I don't know how, how that is determined. Then he has his hat with the antenna. And he has pretty much all his details. He has, um, you know, the side things. I don't know what those are called. There's uh, this grid. You know, it's a. I don't know what. He has his, uh, you know, switches uh, in the same position that they're on Gmod. He has his little. Buttons, yes, the Puzzle Vision logo is in white, uh, not black. Uh, I think it would have made more sense to be black, but you know, I don't care. This is so cool that they added it still. And then, yep, and then at the back has all the details. Um, he has the ports, he has his, uh, his uh, neck thing wires that connect his head to his body. He also has the grid stuff down here. He has the, and he has uh, his uh, this puzzle little, um, I don't know what the fuck they're called, the things that attaches uh, his pants to his uh, you know, overall. I don't, I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. And then he has his bow tie, nice bow tie. Um, he also has his buttons, this one's a bit tilted. I don't know why. This is a puzzle pattern on his. Uh, pants. He has his shoes. They have the detail that they have in Gmod. So does his gloves. There's also a little thing here. Uh, you know the tag. Let's see what it says on the side. Oh, Mr. Puzzles. That's the glitch in the Century Four logo. Warning: choking hazards. Oh no. So that's his ass. Let me get another shot of his ass. Hang on. Oh. There we are. This is ours. Pretty good. This is pretty good quality. I'm liking it. The only issue is that there are some bits that are a bit off. Obviously, uh, not design wise. I mean, like, obviously, this wasn't. It didn't came in the best condition possible. It's not bad condition. It's just. You can see the button is a, a bit off. The button is a bit off here. You can see the face thing here. Uh, you know, but hey, that actually let's let us look at what he uh what he uh inside the screen looks like, which is just grey. That's what it looks like in there. And then I'll get a view like that. And I yeah. So pretty cool. Uh, pretty cool. Uh, yeah, that's uh, the end of the video, I guess. Um, yeah. I, I guess that's it. I KILL YOURSELF!